someone asked a really great question the other day and it was something along the lines of Karen is so vicious what happens when she has to see the vet and the truth is is that it takes a lot of preparation none for Karen just all for the vet you know what I'm being dramatic it doesn't take a lot of extra preparation. The vet just needs to remember to pack that extra pair of underwear when they leave in the morning. Cool your jets, please. And let me be very clear. I love our vet. Our vet is an absolute professional. He sees this type of thing all the time. Maybe not in emus, but have you ever seen a chihuahua being taken to the vet? It's that kind of energy. So they've seen it before. But I digress. Today, Karen has a tick on her neck. So won't you join me in either removing a tick from Karen's neck or I guess watching my murder? I don't know or just decides to have a big diarrhea on screen. Come here. The trick is, to get her head. Come here, Karen, I have a coupon for you. Come here, come here. Good girl. She's way more delightful. Now, Karen, you have a tick right here. You are very dandruffy today. You gotta get back on the bird version of head and shoulders. I think it's just head and neck and neck and creepy little wings, maybe. There you go. And because Karen was a very brave girl today, I got a grape for her. That was not nice, that was for Karen. You're welcome.